got the room right? Um, I think it's 274, as far as I remember. I know it's around this Mother, we're on the here. fourth floor. Why would it be room 274? Are you sure it's oh, not room 472? No, it's in. Yes. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Now, just stay there. Let me open the door for you. Lucy? Oh, oh dear. Yes. Hi, Mother Quartermain. Hello, dear. So nice to see you. Oh, my goodness. These are just lovely. You shouldn't have. That's what I said, but she insisted. Oh, sorry. Tracy, Tracy. Um, could you please, Tracy, just set these over here? You know, I'm a little weak to turn to reach. Really? You look so good. You must be healthy as a horse. <sighs> Feel better. Love, Decker. Doesn't he have a way with words? How are you feeling, dear? Oh, um, well, like I said, Mother Quartermain, I, I am still a little weak, but I'll be all right. Oh, I'm sure you will, dear. I'm so sorry about the baby. Yes, Mother Quartermain, thank you. We had been by sooner if you'd let us. Oh, well, you know, today was the first day that I really felt up to visitors. Well, then that's a very good sign. You're <laughs> feeling better. Yes. Uh, when are they going to let you out? Soon, I hope. Uh, you know, I feel so guilty about not being able to be there to help you run the great big old mansion. Oh, I just feel terrible. Oh, don't worry, Lucy. We can handle it all on our lonesome. By the way, Mother, we have to stop by ELQ. I have a meeting with the lawyers. Oh. Really? About what? Trust fund. Tracy, not now. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was insensitive of me. Um, what trust fund? Are, are you talking about my child's trust fund? Yes, Lucy. Uh, now that you're not... Well, you won't be needing it, will you? Perhaps now wasn't exactly the right time to talk about the trust fund. I'm sorry. You're absolutely right about that. I apologize again, but you do understand, don't you? Oh, yes, Tracy, I understand just perfectly. Well, I knew you would. However, I would have preferred if you'd not spoken to the lawyer until I have a chance to talk to Alan. Alan? Why? Well, I, I think that maybe, I, I don't know, he might want to keep the trust fund as, as a sort of memorial to our child. Um, I rather doubt that, Lucy. Why? Well, Alan, um, Alan had a talk with us about, um, about, um, oh dear, how, how can I put this? We know Scott's the father. That is simply not true. Really? Want to take a test to prove it? Oh, Tracy, that's quite enough now. I mean, Lucy's been through a very trying experience. Yes, yes, I have. It's been just awful. Well, there's nothing like a cruise to lift the spirits. A cruise? Mm -hmm. It's all arranged, dear. Six weeks in the lovely, fresh sea air. Oh, si six weeks. Well, I think it'll do both you and Alan good. Alan's going with me on the cruise. Um, no, dear. I, um, I thought that it would uh, do you both good to have a little time apart to get things in their right perspective. Uh, well, Mother Quartermain, that is such a nice offer. I appreciate it. I really do. Um, but I, I just don't think now's the time. Oh, Lucy, you know, I think you ought to think about it. You know, there's a world of possibilities on cruises. There's gambling for distraction. I do not gamble. Well, I think you ought to start, because you might be able to parlay a single dollar into a million. You're gonna need it. I wouldn't worry about me if I were you, Tracy. I'm quite capable of taking care of myself. Oh, I really think you should do it, Lucy. Ah. <sighs> Well, if you think so, Mother Quartermain, then, then I do agree. And thank you. That, that's very kind. If, if, if you don't mind, I, I'm, I'm truly very tired right now. Oh, of course, dear. You will get some rest now. Uh, be good, just girl. think, Lucy, in a few days, you're going to be on a nice, long cruise. that easy they have another thing coming what what my dear Scott no 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 my my darling my darling Scott 
Son of a gun, he's foreclosing on you? I stand to lose everything, Scotty. Everything. Well, you know what? You're going to have to reconsider Decker's offer. No way. I just don't understand why Ned is coming after me like this. Well, it's pretty obvious. I mean, Decker and, and Ned, they hate each other. Yeah. Well, I thought of that. Not to mention the fact that he's a quarterman, and take it from me, those quartermains, they'd sell their grandmother down the river if they thought they could make themselves yeah, a buck. Yeah. I'll get it. Yeah, Scott Baldwin? Who died? Sign here, please. Flowers, huh? Who they send me flowers? There you go, pal. Thanks. <coughs> here. Oh, yeah, right. Wait, 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 wait just a second. I know what you're after. And there you go. Excuse me of not being a big tipper. Thanks, man. Right. So, what's the occasion? I have no idea. My darling Scott, I'm so sorry for everything I said to you. I'm going to lash out at you because Losing our child was so devastating. I didn't mean any of it. When I said, please, I need to see you. Oh, my love, Lucy. That chance went to lies. So, uh, secret admirer, maybe? Or... It's your cousin, Lucy. Lucy? Why would she be sending you flowers? Who knows? Who cares? I'm just asking. Look, uh, about the club. I just... But you know what? If your cousin has got so much money to go out sending flowers to people, maybe she can loan you some money to get your club back together. Lucy has problems of her own right now. Ha, ha, I... ha, ha, yeah. Well, to start with, her brain, you know? The nerve of that girl. What does she think I am Scott, here? there's got to be something that we can do about the foreclosure on the club. She's gotta up to some something. Kind of... That's what she's up to. Up okay, to something what? shifty here. What? I'm asking you what you think. Forget it. For just... About the club. Let me tell you okay, something, okay? Can... Your cousin is a banana case. That's what she is. She's a have banana. More important things in my mind. The nerve right of her. You know what she's thinking? I'm going to come grappling back to her because she sends me some flowers? Look, she's out of her mind, is God, what she is. God. I'm going to leave. Wait a second, wait a second. What, what were you just saying? We were talking about the. Uh, the club. club. Forget it. It's obvious that your mind is on Lucy right now, so I'll deal with it. I'm no, gonna... I don't care about Lucy. Forget about her. Let's talk about what we're talking Why about. Why don't you just go to the hospital? I wouldn't go want. to the hospital if you rolled out the red carpet from there to here. All right, whatever. But just call me. You've got my number. If you think of anything that might help, you let me know, okay? Yeah, yeah, okay, Colton. I'll, I'll, I'll give it some thought. I'll get on it. All right? Thanks. Okay, I'll see you later. Flowers. Flowers before. My darling Scott. I'm so sorry. Everything I said to you, I only lashed out at you because of losing our, our, oh, it's our child all of a sudden. <laughs> oh, God. Devastating. I didn't mean any of what I said to you. See me. Oh, my love. My love. All right. I'll go see you. I'll give you two minutes, is what I'll give you. Hi. How are you? Okay. Uh, listen, I, I wanted you to know I was sorry to hear about Lucy's miscarriage. Thank you. How is she? She's doing fine. You know, Lucy, she's a survivor. <laughs> yes, I know. I was married to her once. Yeah, I remember. You know, she's not the easiest person in the world to understand, don't you? That's an understatement. But she did just lose a child, which can be a very devastating experience. So, uh... You know, maybe that can bring the two of you closer together. I doubt that. You could give it a try. Tony, there are extenuating circumstances about this pregnancy that you don't... Mm. No, whatever, but just don't be hasty in your judgment. Because I almost made that same mistake. But with Bobby, what are you talking about? You've got a marriage that people dream about. Yeah, except I almost threw it away yesterday. Why? I thought she was having an affair. Bobby? Well, she wasn't. But see, I misinterpreted her behavior. And I let my own insecurities get to me, and I was wrong, and you could be wrong about Lucy. I doubt it, but... You know about misinterpreting 
Um, what? I was very... I was very upset with Lucy just prior to the miscarriage. Are you blaming yourself for the miscarriage? I'm not... I'm not saying that. I was very angry. I, I just would hate to think that it was... it was my fault in any way. I... You need to talk to somebody. Come with me. 